Beyonce continues to make history as the first black female artist to ever reach number one on Billboard's Hot Country chart with her new song, Texas Hold'em. She joins a list, though, of many other talented black country artists who are drawing diversity to the popular genre. Well, News Channel 5's Aaron Cantrell tells us more about the contributions of African-American musicians to this genre, and actually, it's happened since the very beginning. We may not be in Texas, but even in Music City, Beyonce is laying her cards down. Being completely open and honest as she takes on country music. It's a fun song, and it's a catchy song, and it's Beyonce, so I mean, it's a global superstar. One of her singles, Texas Hold'em, is creating heat waves across country music radio stations, including here at 103.3. Oh, I love that little, like, jazzy thing at the end. There's never been a truer uh, display of a melting pot musically, I think, right now than, you know, we have in country music today. Look at Jelly Roll, we got Kane Brown, you know, we got Lainey Wilson, and Beyonce. Beyonce preserves the best of country past and evolves us into a country future that we have never seen. Alice Randall, the first black woman to write a number one country single, thinks Texas Hold'em and B's other single, 16 Carriages, reminds the public where country music originated from. There is no country music that exists without black brilliance, genius, and artistry. Sounds we hear on the steel guitar are sounds that we first came out of black throats and mouths, bringing traditions from Africa. Over the decades, black artists and musicians' contributions have been dimmed, but Randall thinks Beyonce is bringing their legacies back. It is so much a full circle moment for me that I almost want to cry. I wanted to see a black woman get to the top of the charts. And I can retire now. And so far, this Beyonce heat wave isn't cooling off, even getting the approval from another legendary queen. I think she's fantastic and beautiful and I love her music. Can't get a better endorsement than that. 1033 Country. I am here for the Beyonce. And I don't care what anybody else says. <laughs> In Nashville, Erin Cantrell, New Channel 5. Now, Beyonce's other country song, 16 Carriages, debuted at number nine. Not bad. Alice, who we just heard from, is actually releasing a book in April. It's called My Black Country, exploring and tracing the history of African Americans in country music. We have more details for you on newschannel5.com.